हेलो हाउ आर यू ऑल आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग वेल एंड हैप्पी दिवाली टू ऑल ऑफ यू एज यू ऑलरेडी नो दैट माय नेम इज रितु एंड इन दिस सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस द फर्स्ट ग्लोबल ट्री असेसमेंट एंड दिस प्रोग्राम इज इन न्यूज सो दिस सेशन इज इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर यू जी एस थ्री पर्सपेक्टिव मूविंग टूवर्ड्स द पॉइंट ऑफ डिस्कशन पार्ट so first of all we are going to discuss the news then we are going to discuss about the findings then we are going to discuss about practice question for prelims before that you have to like share and subscribe to this tis channel moving towards the news part so as you already know that we had discussed about the uh, conference of parties which is cop 16 of convention of biological diversity and during that diversity a report has been released and that has highlighted the findings of first global tree assessment and this has been released by IUCN which is International Union for Conservation of Nature and we are going to discuss what are the findings of this report and this is basically for the tree breeds and tree experiments and how many trees and how many species of trees are on the verge of extinction now we'll come to the findings part the findings is that Out of forty-seven thousand two eighty-two tree species, at least sixteen thousand four twenty-five are on the extinct. So what we can see that they are facing danger. So the this report has also highlighted that every third tree is facing threat, and the number of threatened tree species are more than double the number of all threatened birds, mammals, reptiles, amphibians combined. so what we can see that uh, if we'll see that in terms of birds in terms of mammals in terms of reptiles and amphibians the number of trees are doubled in terms of threatening so trees are more into a vulnerable kind of situation and tree species are at the risk into the 192 countries so you can see that almost all over the world the trees are on the verge of extinction and various breeds and various species of trees are on the extinction now we'll come to the next one next finding is about the that what this uh, assessment present so this assessment present the global threat to the trees and different species and how we can mitigate such kind of the problem so it gives you the guidelines that this is the data we have that these kind of trees are on the extinction these uh, kind of trees are threatened these kind of trees are into the vulnerable condition these countries has a larger number of extinction thing so that gives the road map to all over the world that how to save our tree species how to conduct afforestation how to conduct reforestation and islands are particularly vulnerable because of the forest clearance urban development and various climate change kind of the problems and you can see that invasive species pest and disease further exacerbated the threats so these are about that uh, these action and these assessment tells that uh, not just trees are on the extinction because so many livelihoods are dependent on the trees because so many communities are dependent on the trees and forest and their produce the mammals birds and so many uh people who uh, so many uh, what you can say living organisms are part of this ecosystem and tree played a very important role into their lives including human also so if the trees are into the vulnerable condition so it's not just that forest are dying people are also dying animals are also dying and birds are also dying so this is a very integrated approach in which we can see that every lives is correlated with each other so that's why the importance of tree is very much uh, highlighted in this report now we'll come to the another one uh, as you uh, it has also given the example of south america and south america boasts that it has the highest varieties of trees but what we can see that out of 13668 species 3356 are on the verge of extinction and they are on the risk and they are threatened and the report also under underscored the impact of climate change which heightened the risk particularly in tropical region and india is also a part of semi tropical region so we are also facing such kind of the problems we have also problem of rising sea levels increasingly frequent and 
severe storms so this report has highlighted and this is the first of its kind of report which has highlighted numerous uh, trees condition there is species and this shows that you know how to uh, conduct our behavior further and what kind of behavior are ecological behavior suppose that if we have data that this tree is dying this species is dying so we have to do reforestation into that area and reforestation is not only the solution we have to also look for the conservation of those trees that which species are dies we have to find that what are the medicinal importance what are the commercial importance a tree has and on the basis of that we have to run a plantation drive of separate species and separate trees we often see that for climate change for any kind of climate action people always conduct a forestation and which is a very good step but here if we'll have a such kind of assessment it will have a clear idea that which kind of breeds uh, we need for this particular area and what is the commercial value what is the medicinal value what is the oxygenal value and you already know the importance of trees trees plays a very important play in our life it provides oxygen it sinks carbons and it ha what you can say it is a genesis of our life because of trees we are also here and so many living organisms are also here so this is very important to think about the trees and not just a forestation we have to also look for the further future drives which needs to be strengthened and we need to preserve our forest because in this report the forest clearance is one of the regions we can see that so many species of trees are dying so this is very much important now we'll come to the question down the question is very much simple because we already had discussed about the 16 conference of parties which is on convention of biological diversity held and here they are asking that where was it is held and currently it is also going so it is in going process so you have to find out the place geneva switzerland cali colombia nairobi kenya paris france so this is very easy one you have to answer this into the comment section and you have to also prepare that who had prepared this particular assessment what is the role of iucn what is the red list so you have to know all these details about the iucn red list vulnerable species of the trees how trees and different living organisms are interconnected with each other so how trees and reforestation can help in carbon sinking process so these are the possible areas you have to ponder on so that's it for today's session i hope you like this session if you have any queries related to this session kindly ask in the comment section thank you have a nice day happy diwali to all of you for more informative content like share and subscribe and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications